Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're taking a quick look at the new update for Film Convert Nitrate. Now I'm using version 3.59 and as of today, we can now grade our footage directly inside Film Convert Nitrate for the uh, DJI Pocket 3 D-Log. This is very exciting. Um, I've been waiting for this for a little while now. So let me just adjust this so you can see the nodes. So we don't need any elaborate node trees. I have just a adjustment layer and then my node for film nitrate. Now you can go ahead and download a free trial for this. And if we just jump over to Chrome inside Film Nitrate, you can see it's available for Premiere. It's available for After Effects, DaVinci Resolve, Final Cut Pro and, and Motion. So if we go to supported cameras, you can see inside here, it will list all of the cameras that Film Nitrate supports. And if we click on DJI, this is such a new um, option that it's not even um, noted inside their website yet. I had an email notification this morning letting me know that um, it's now available. So that is very exciting. Let's go through a few of the different film emulations inside Film Convert. I'm just going to toggle my grade on and off so you can see what's going on. So I'm going to go Shift D and that's going to bypass all the grades and the looks. So as you can see, that's the D log straight out of camera. I am shooting in uh, 60 frames a second, 4K on the Pocket 3, which is just a fantastic camera. None of this footage is stabilized. It's all straight out of camera. The gimbal is so smooth. And once you've got used to steadying the camera with your arm, just absorbing the shocks, you can get this footage where it is super silky smooth. Uh, if you just absorb a little bit of that bounce with your arm, there's still a little bit of bounce in there, um, but you're gonna get that. It's never gonna be dead flat. Right, so film stocks. So I'm in a Fuji emulation at the moment. Let's go from the top. So we've got some Kodak ones. And yeah, I'm just gonna go through all of these just so you can get an idea of what they look like. Really beautiful grading. And it's just so easy to do this inside DaVinci now and obviously inside any other um, editor that you might be using. Uh, Velvia, that's quite nice. Love that one. They got some black and white options. I think that's an Alpha Delta there. So we can go to this one has slightly more grain. If you have the grain on, it is um, quite system intensive and it's going to slow your system down a bit. So or if you want to put grain on, just put it on at the end and then render it out. So we have a I'm guessing this is a Fuji H400 Pro. And then we have Fuji Super X 400, beautiful colors again. Then we have a Kodak 400 Portra. And at the bottom here, we have a Polaroid 600. And that is quite nice. So yeah, you have a few parameters. There's not too many, it's not too overwhelming. You have the option of being able to purchase um, halation if you need that at a later date. I have turned off my grain so I can just turn that on and off. You can just about see that. Yeah, I will link to a free trial for Film Nitrate. I'm not affiliated with them, so I don't get a cut of any of the signups, um, but go ahead and try it out and let me know in the comments below what you think. See you on the next one. Bye for now.